Hey guys, so I just played a couple games of Dodrio. This is essentially like my first impressions of each of the movesets. And honestly, they're both really cool. Let me know what you think of Dodrio in the comments, which moveset you like the best, but I hope you guys enjoy this video. Hey guys, gonna play some Dodrio today. I wasn't able to get the jungle, so we're gonna, uh... oh my goodness. <laughs> we're gonna uh, go into the top lane. Uh, this character is uh, kind of hard to control. I uh, haven't really played it. I messed around like a little bit in one game and I, uh... Did not hit abilities, so we're gonna we're gonna try this time. Um, it's pretty cool, pretty cool mon. Uh, I am stacking. I do want to try to pressure their Natus here. Uh, that would be awesome. I did not get their Natus, but I am gonna fight this. I am gonna actually try to. I should have full healed and run. I um, yeah, that's my bad. That's my bad. So I'll talk you through my thought process there. I play a lot of Wigglytuff competitively. I expected a slap stun into a double knock up slap stun. Like that's just what I do. But like I should not expect that from other players because they are definitely are not me. Um, I'm gonna run it this way and just get away from this. This is really tough to fight. It's a member swine in the zoom rule. Uh, I should be able to just get this and fine and just punish them for this overextension. I've got to watch out for the bird. He can one shot me even on the goal. Uh, here we go and now there we go. That looked like the good moment. I don't know if I win this. I don't. It's so squishy. It's it's definitely not a Lena. It does not feel like a Lena. I cannot brawl out with anyone. Uh, it definitely feels like a jungler, but when you're forced to play it in lane, you're forced to play it in lane. So I'm going to do what I can with it, but yeah, it just definitely does not feel like a lane. Maybe if I play really passive and try to steal, but playing into a, a Mamo Swine, it's just really, really hard. They have their power spike, which is really, really rough for me. They're already six. Um, yeah, it's really rough that I didn't get the jungle this game, but we're going to try to... We're going to try, right? We're going to try. We're going to do what we can. Uh, we do have... We're full healing just to get away from all this nonsense, and we probably just go down anyway. We're gonna try to we're gonna try really hard to just get out of here. If we can score a bottom, that's huge. We run past them just to get a stack. No, we can't even get a stack. We're just trying to do something, but no room to breathe. No room to breathe on the entire map, unfortunately. Um we're gonna we're gonna go back. We're gonna go back up here. Um they should hopefully get punished for running down there. If not, I'm gonna try to like there's nothing even to farm here. I'm gonna have to jungle. What's going on, man? What's going on? Like, what is this? <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> like, <laughs> oh man, everyone is everywhere. It's very weird. Yeah, overstaying in lane is so like normal now. It's crazy. I have to watch out because if the other Dodrio comes in with stack passive, I'm in big trouble. Yep, there they are. There they are. And now I get to come around the back and actually punish them. That's, um, yeah, they have the focus band on the Mamo Swine. But we, we were able to turn that around pretty well for what it was. Um, We definitely want to, um, we do want to get a stack if we can. It's just really hard. Memo Swine is tough to get by. It's very tough to get by. Um, that move hurts a lot. Let's go with some damage here, though. Oh, oh, no. They're all here. Oh, no. They're all here. Get out. We must run. I don't know if I get out of here. I'm going to try to run the long path. Yeah, I'm really fast, especially with the float stone. This is a tough one. All right. They are here. All right. This person should be done now. There we go. All right. We get that pick. This mod is strange. It feels weird to not press your, uh, your basic attacks. It feels very... Uh, unnatural because when you press your basics you'll use your booster like your gauge and you'll dash through um so i'm gonna run back and forth in this push to get my passive up it feels super weird uh but i like it it's just super weird there we go there we go that's their unite we're gonna have to store behind here here we go nope we missed the initial hit we have to dash out of there and be safe we have to watch the goal we have to watch out if we go in they're gonna go in on us we dodge them and now we push them here Oh, we both miss each other. <laughs> Everyone's still getting used to this mon. It's super strange. Oh, they're doing it. Can I Can I steal? All right, it's still not low enough to steal. All right, our deck is on it. Let's go here. I believe huge, huge. Good job, Dexter. This is Good job, this is your Got to watch out for the talent. We don't want to get our... Uh... Yeah, there they are. <laughs> they just didn't care if they fainted. They just wanted to kill the guy with YT in his name. You get that a lot. <laughs> that's one rough thing, right? So that's never the right play from the talent flame. That leaves this goal vulnerable. Now they can't defend it because they wanted to kill the YT guy. So it's hard to account for plays that aren't optimal because there's no reason to ever do that unless you just want to ego kill the guy with YT in his name. So uh, we couldn't predict that play. But yeah, that was the play that they made, unfortunately. Uh, we're going to farm these up. It feels so awkward. Um, I wish I could like, you know, basic attack in between my... Uh, my moves that would feel better <laughs> that would feel better but I, it's still solid i just t pose that was cool that does reset your gauge though so you could attack into doing that uh we don't really want to deal with a memo swine all right this okay I'm, I'm over people all right stop egoing me 
Stop egoing me. <laughs> Stop it. No more egoing me. Yeah, I have YT in my name. Cool. Go away. No. No. Yes, Decidueye. Yes, Decidueye. I had my back, dude. What a homie. What an actual homie. No. No. All right, look. Backing there wasn't the most intelligent decision. But I just did not... I don't know. I didn't see them walking into that bush. I thought about it and I was like, no. Like, it wouldn't make sense. Um... And because I'd stopped moving, I didn't have my uh, my dash up. So this isn't a dash, like draw pack. It's not a dash if your gauge isn't full. You can see the bar gets longer. So that's something I got to get used to. I didn't have that safety of a dash. So I, I, making a risky play like that was just silly on my behalf. Uh, there's the memo. There is a mime on them. Look at this. Mime's on them. They still hit me. Now Azu unites me. I can't. If you stop my momentum, I'm just useless. It's crazy. So that's really weird. Like if you knock me up at all, my gauge isn't full. I don't have my boosted move. It feels really strange. It feels really strange, and there's so many micro stuns in this game that I don't know if this Pokemon could literally be played in a competitive setting. Uh, I guess it, if it comes in late in the fight, right, you'd have a real team fight, and people would really be doing things uh, like here, right? I could come in here and just take this guy out. <laughs> this is a bit strange. That wouldn't be a real team fight setting. But I'm saying like, oh, there's the Talon. Um, they're behind. They still have. They rather have they move up, right? No. They played that well. They played that well. All right, here's that. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Dude came out the cut. All right. Their team is around. We've got to watch out for the Decidueye. Um, we are very low. We are very, very low, but we cannot stop moving. No moving, stopping, stopping moving. This is hard. I should not be here at this health, but I really want to help the team. All right. They're uniting. That's actually big. That's big. That's big. Where's the moment? Here it is. Here it is. All right. Now we full heal so we can move. This is why I'm picking full heal. I don't want to get stuck in these positions. I want to be able to move my Pokemon. Oh, oh, <laughs> nice job, Decidueye. Let's go. Birds working together. The burb brains, the burb brains. This feels so solid. Like, it's really fun. It feels really strange. Oh my goodness, I'm squishy. I am super squishy. I just want to secure this. There we go. All right, stun the Azu. There we go. Move around. I like that you can kick, stun, and move. It's really cool that you can just kick off a wall, stun, and move. You can kick off these walls and go over. It's really cool. Uh, I do want to back and heal. I'm very, very low. Ah, oh, man. It's cool getting to know a new Pokemon, right? Like, I played it in lane. It's not where it's played. Um, it's really tough to lane this Pokemon, for sure. Uh, the no moving, like, if your momentum stops at all, it's really, really hard. Really, really hard. But it's super cool. Like, I like this design. I think, like, if this came into a team fight, like, midway, like a flanker, like it's supposed to be played, with, like, Fed XP from a jungle, it would just one-shot everyone. It would be really, really impressive. But in solo queue settings, unless you're just split pushing, I don't really see a way to play this mod. And even then, right, it's hard to split push. If I run into their talent or something, all right, their memo split pushing, so I'm going to try to do the same. I haven't really been stacking it all either. I'll definitely get at least some of these points in because my passive, which is really solid. Really solid. Okay. Really solid. Really solid. Um... I'm trying to kick away. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Well, that's Azu's Unite. I don't think that's that big a deal, right? Because Azu can't just rip this in 20 seconds. My team shouldn't either. <laughs> Sidui. Sidui. Yo, we're winning. Homie. Homie, we're winning. Blastoise, brother. See, this is the hard thing about falling in solo queue. People make these choices. Um, We're winning the game. <laughs> so I'm going to... I'm going to jump and I'm going to try to just ensure our victory the best that I can here by literally all ending this thing with everything I have. I'm literally... Oh, let's look. Let's watch. And I want to hit it with my... Go Decidueye. Decidueye? Decidueye! I was doing it for him. And no. And no. That's really cool. Oh, I hate being put in positions like that. I'm going to upload this anyway because literally this game was a win if a team didn't throw. And, um... We probably still win anyway. Yeah, they killed them, I guess. Unless Azu scores the 25, that could stop us from winning. Now we don't know. Uh, the Sigil is probably going to get the shield broken. If No, it's not. I'm going to vibe. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, man. Right, I'm going to upload this anyway. Uh, this was my first impression of this moveset of Dojuria. I'm going to try the other one now and upload this in the video. But uh, I'm going to do my best to run across the map super far. Um, if I can get there and score some points, it's huge. Because I do have Floatstone. I do have dashes i do have the dodrio score mechanic if i can get to a goal we're solid can we win the game with dodrio can we do it right here let's go we're gonna get some points in we get some in we get some in 
We get some in. <laughs> I doubt that's enough, but we scored some points. <laughs> no, guys. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm uploading this. This is what solo queue looks like. Um, Wiggly's just scored 60. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to show you guys the score. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. This was crazy and mental. Uh, it, how to throw a game 101 and we probably still won it. That's what just happened. <laughs> how to throw a game 101 and we probably still won it. But yeah, that's um, that's solo queue. And that's Dodrio. Uh, and that's the one move set. Let's see what the score is and we'll move on to the next game. And we lose. And we lose. All right, next game. Hey, guys. All right, so this time I forced my way into the jungle. Uh which is good, but I'm going to be trying the other moveset. I'm going to be trying the uh, the Tri-Attack Agility moveset. Now, I don't know if it's any good. Uh, I've changed my build up because I know these moves can't crit, so I've taken off the Scope Lens, and I put on a Score Shield for like late game pushes because a uh, Score Shield in that game would have won me the game. <laughs> I really would have won if I had it. So we're going to try this one out and see how it goes. Um, we're going to luckily be jungling, so it's going to be hard to get a, a scope on which of the moves is really truly better right because we're going to be more fed in this game we're going to have our power spikes when we should have them and not um super late it's really hard to gauge this uh speed thing you really can't basic attack you really can't basic attack i've got to get the hang of this like you've got to like move and then do that and not get it interrupted by the game. <laughs> uh it's weird it's weird to be like this i think i think the quickest way to clear though is just to spam the abilities in basic i don't think you can stall around uh so we're gonna try try attack and we're going to um so this is a range attack when i'm like this right yeah okay that's cool oh it doesn't take the gauge did that not take the gauge wait oh maybe it did maybe it didn't i don't know we're learning we're learning we're learning as we go <laughs> we're learning the new pokemon as we go here we go right here oh okay it gets like another charge oh i'm dead unless we dodge that huge huge okay I'm here for this. All right, we dash away and we dodge. And now we want to chase this guy. Come here, Gengar. Can we do it? All right, we want to dodge him. We don't want to get Dream it's, it, it Once we miss the ability, it's too late. <laughs> once we miss the ability, it's too late and we got to go. Um, I don't want to risk going for the eights without at least like my red or something. I need something to fight. Oh, it's so awkward. All right, we're getting the hang of this. We're getting the hang of this. All right, we've got agility now. We've got agility now. We're going to do this blue and then we're going to head there. It, oh, that just instantly fills it up. Okay. So we can double shoot. We can double shoot range shots. And then we get another charge of this move, it seems. It, I'm so confused. <laughs> I did a video on these moves, and, and I'm so confused. Oh, yeah, we do get another. Uh, all right, this is cool. This is cool. We're going to do this. We're going to keep our passive. This is cool. We can keep our passive up and just pepper from range. This is really interesting. It's really interesting. Oh. There's too many of them here for me to actually do anything, unfortunately. I've got to stay moving. It's weird that you like have to stay moving on the one. Really cool, though. <laughs> so that gets rid of... <laughs> it's so strange. All right, cool. Here we go. I'm enjoying it, though. I'm having a fun time playing this mod. It's kind of refreshing. I know there's that Altera in the lane, but I just want to... Um, I want to get my buffs. They're going to spawn any second now because of the time that I cleared. And it's going to guarantee me 9 and I can come to the lane at a, uh, a strong level. So they should spawn around now. Yeah, there we go. You gotta keep eyes on your timers of when things spawn. This is cool. This is cool. Yeah, the agility uh, gauge filling is really cool. I'd love to try that out with uh, with Joel Peck. But Stomp felt like really solid with it, to be fair. Um, all right. Okay. And now we walk to lane and we're nine. Uh, which is pretty solid. Okay. <laughs> we get our spike. We're a bit late. We didn't get it as quick as we'd like to. Um, I do want to, like... I do want to pick up the tempo here. I do want to... Um, or some pressure. So I'm going to poke the mime. Oh, that's really solid. Oh, that's really solid. That's really nice. Now we boosted. There we go. And now we poke the Zera. There we go. Huge, 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 huge. We poke them again. We unite on both of them here because they're both on goal here. Huge. We can boost it. We can go back into this. I like this move set. I like this move set a lot. Now we get. Oh, we can't overcap on this Pokemon. That's what's sad. We had a big 40 overcap. We can't get it. I like this move set a lot. I like the, the mobility of it. I like the way you can move around. I really, really enjoy it. I like agility a lot. Agility is solid. I feel really, really strong on this Pokemon right now. I feel really... Like, oh, look at that. I like the fact that I can use my basic attack and then I can use agility and just get another one. I like that a lot. Uh, this is cool. This is cool. If I had um, Drill Peck here, I'd feel more comfortable about pushing this. I'm going to pepper them with some damage. Like, why not? Right? I can. I have that luxury and they're going to back off. Good job, Charizard. Now we get some big score. Big score. Is that a big one score there because of the way it works? 
All right, so we're gonna we're gonna get our passive up here. We're gonna turn and we're gonna pepper this guy, right? We don't want to get united. We're gonna actually back up that way. We're gonna move with agility and we're gonna come back, right here. We're gonna move. There's the unite. We're gonna dodge the knock up. We're gonna dodge the knock up. Yo, let's go, Blissey. Let's go. We want speed. Speed. We're too fast. We're speed demons. Come back here. You can't run from me. You can't run from me. You can't. No, Gengar. No, Gengar. Don't ruin everything. Don't ruin everything. <laughs> oh, we tunnel vision so hard. I really wanted to catch them. If I didn't mess up my basic attack, so on this character, the basic attacks only go the way you're facing. So I wasn't facing them. It's not going to auto lock onto him like any other character. I had to face them. If I faced them properly, I caught them, which shows this Pokemon's really good at chasing down. It's actually really cool. I'm really enjoying... Oh, okay. <laughs> That's what happens when you play an inconsistent ping all the time. Even on green, you just mess up your jump pad. All right. So the beauty of this is now I can pepper this, right? I can hit it with the basic, and then I can agility and get that. That's so cool. Agility is really cool. I like agility a lot. I like Dodrio. This moveset is actually a lot of fun. I could play a lot of this moveset. Uh, it looked like the weaker one to me, but it just feels solid. It feels good. Um, I feel like I'm just peppering them constantly and I feel I feel like I'm a threat. I feel threatening. I feel really threatening. I like that I can do this. This is my favorite part about it. The agility just getting my uh, my ability back up is really, really cool. I'm gonna, oh no, <laughs> see, that's the thing. You've got to face the right way and that's what I'm gonna have to get used to. They've got that buff. Uh, we've got to be careful of that. That is a mime. I don't know why we're fighting him. It is a mime. He's literally a mime. <laughs> uh, I don't know if uh, Lissy got the memo about mime. He's a little bit balanced at the moment. Um, we're going to full heal the power swap off because you can do that. And we're going to just you know, pepper the mime. Get him out of there. Get out of there. All right. Now let's look back here. I don't want to get Gengar. That is the last thing I want to happen. So we're going to keep moving around. Keep out. All right. There is the mime. There is mime. He likes us. Mime likes us. Mime's our homie, our friend. Oh, no. All right. We've got to move. We're dead. <laughs> yeah, it just like, it felt really stolen. Mew's kind of just like taking our jungle. I guess they just didn't want to come up for the fight. I mean, it happens. Um, yeah, that was rough. Like it felt very, Charles, I wanted to rip it. So I was like, I'll go rip it. We just got kind of out macro there. We got out rotated on as a team. Like they just, they responded really well. <laughs> That's all it really is. <sighs> I'm telling you, this is so hard solely for the reason that I play on inconsistent being every game. The jump pad is my worst enemy. And it's, it's really unfortunate with that. That's part of living in my region, right? It's never the same uh, speed of input. They have to do it at a different speed in certain regions, which is uh, really cool. Really cool. So Mew took that, which is fine. Mew with the blue buff is is solid. I like having it, though, with the peppering of this set. It feels really good. Like, this feels solid, right? And I get another... Like, ah, oh, I like this. I like this a lot. Oh, we want to dodge the Sijuai. There's Gengar. Let's get out of here. I like how fast I am. I like how fast I am. I wish I was using my Scorchard more. I was actually playing scory but i'm having too much fun i'm having too much fun i might actually go look to score some more points and get another stack real quick because i can right look how fast i am like they're not going to stop me scoring this it's a small overcap of course because this pokemon can't overcap which is really uh not the greatest but we're just so fast we're just so fast and i love that i love being this speedy it feels really solid to be this fast um I'm definitely not playing it well. I'm missing all my boosted basic attacks. I'm uh, I miss timing a lot of abilities. There's definitely a lot more attacks I get off with in between these agilities, right? I'm definitely not using agility optimally. Definitely not. But um, I'm having a great time. <laughs> I'm having a great time. And this move set makes me really like the Pokemon. The last move set feels very like all in divey. This is like pokey, which is cool. All right, we're in the lead. We're in the lead. I'm gonna look to like sneak into the base and score. I feel like this one can score really well into bases. Um, bases, I feel like we can score really well. We're going to just zoom, zoom, zoom. Zoom, zoom, zoom to base. And we're going to just like hit this button and score. And then run on out, right? Why not give us a bigger lead? I mean, if they don't want to do anything, I'll farm their stuff and, and score it. I don't mind. <laughs> I don't mind doing this. This doesn't bother me. I'm completely okay with all this. All right, no, there's a fight starting now. I don't want to leave my team. Oh, no. They're all falling. They're all falling. I've got to get over here. I do not want my team to fall because I wasn't there. That would be a massive throw. There's the Gengar. All right. Mime's going to score. We need to... um. It's rough being a speedster. Engaging as a speedster is just not something you really want to do. So their Mime scoring there. I feel like we're still winning. But our team's likely going to panic, right? That's what tends to happen. And I need to just be kind of careful. Um, and not get hard dove by their team. That was an accident. But we have to roll with it. I did not mean to press that button. But what? Oh my goodness though. Yo. We just... The Sidui is gone. The CGI is gone. I've got to hit more of these boosters because they seem to be very strong. They seem to be very, very strong. Yo, we juke mimes. 
Don't mind. Yo. Out here. Come here. Okay. <laughs> Yo. Let's go. We have a score shield. They're going to score that. We stand up pad for them. And we agility through. Let's go. We have a score shield. We have a score shield. We jump over there. And we get at least some of this in because the way we score. Let's go, Dedrio. What? Why didn't it keep scoring? Why didn't it? Did you guys see that? It stopped scoring. Is that meant to be that way? Oh my god, I'm so fast though. I'm just so fast. It's crazy. No, no one's stopping the Gengar. Yo, Blissey though. Let's go. I think we won Charizard. Reflexes of a tuna fish. All right, cool. Ah. I think we did it. I think we won. I think we were able to pull it off just playing sneaky around the map. This mod is so fun. I like agility. I don't know if tri attacks is that I love, but man, that damage at the end was crazy. But I love agility. I love, 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 love agility. And that was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. I don't know why it stopped scoring then there. I didn't do three scores. I did one score and it stopped. Maybe I bumped something. Maybe I have stick drift. I'm not too sure. I'm not completely positive what happened there. That was fun. We didn't do that much damage, but we ran around the map, but we, we definitely scored and, and caused pressure and tempo. Uh, that's really cool. Uh, what do I think of both sets? Honestly, I think... I like both of them. They both have different applications. I think this set is really, really cool though. And this is the one I would likely play more in a fives unless we had some good engage for me to come in and flank with the other set. Uh, I think Dodrio is solid. I think it's solid and it's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy. And when I can actually play this mod, aim and hit by attacks, I'm sure I will do a, a ton of damage. So as always guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and have a wonderful day.